What's up everybody? Blue Gabe. Look at the weather here in sunny South Florida. 95 degrees, barely any clouds in the sky, just a light breeze. It is so nice. We're here at the Lightsies Family Ranch. We're gonna do things a little bit different in this video. We are gonna go hunt an alligator with an air rifle. But right now, the chef, Chef Mike, who's on a schedule, has us an amazing alligator meal already cooked. Moose, you coming inside? He's the mascot for Lightsey's Family Ranch. Look at the big old deer. I promise you guys, if you ever come to Florida, you want to check this place out. They do nature tours, quail hunts, alligator hunts. You name it, they got it. Look at this place right here. So we got Crystal Beachy, Mr. T-Dubs, Dan Perez, Mr. Austin, Mason, and the star of the show right there, Chef Mike. Tell them what you got made up here. So, you are. so I got a piece of my mouth. Deconstructed gator tail sushi roll with some uh, some homemade eel sauce for Gabe because that's his uh, that's his bread and butter. Some spicy mayo, a little bit of sushi rice, and some uh, pickled uh, Thai cucumber juice. So, Did he just say it? gator sushi? Mm. Deconstructed. Oh, this is the kind of sushi that we can actually make. Y'all right, uh, dig in and let's try it. Come on, Austin, try you some of that. Try. I'm interested in seeing. Does it smell good, baby, or what? Listen, the rice is so good. I think good. I'm gonna need a bigger plate. You guys, look at the lodge. Axis deer, big old giant white tails, a crocodile. Here's an alligator. Mr. Prez is actually here gator hunting too with a bow, right? Sure. Where will they be able to see your hunt? Whitetailproperties.com or that you can always catch it on the on the on the side of Whitetail Properties TV. Awesome. I'll put on that the in the channel. I've actually been watching Mr. Perez for years and years on TV and he walked up and said hi to me and I wasn't paying attention and I heard his voice and that's how I knew who he was, just by his voice. He made a video years ago about a one big whitetail that he was hunting and it changed the way I whitetail hunt now. What y'all think? Really good. You're not talking, so it must be good. It's delicious. <laughs> it's awesome. It's really good, actually. Awesome, what you think? Super tasty. Mike's Mike's a great chef. I'm telling you guys. It's if, cool that it don't even taste. It doesn't even taste like the gator. Gator's so tender. Gator's so tender. It doesn't even taste it's like gator. If for any other reason than the food, you want to come to Lightsey's Family Ranch because that chef right over there and his partner, this dude is legit. Look, here's some leftover lunch that we just mouthed down on. It is so amazing. You can come here just for dinner, go on a nature tour, you don't even have to hunt. They have some five stands for shooting sporting clays. They have a wedding chapel or like a party area. So we're only about a couple hundred yards from the lodge. They've got a bathroom house right here. And check this out right over here, right amongst this beautiful oak hammock. They have this beautiful barn lit up with lights at night. This is about as pretty as it gets. Babe, you think we should have our wedding here? Yeah. How many hotels are here? Like seven rooms, eight rooms? Ten rooms, we sleep 24. Ten rooms, they sleep 24. So you could, especially over the summer, if there's not much going on, you could just drive out here, call ahead, have dinner cooked and have a nice room and just do a ride around the ranch. Bring your wife on a date. This place, you won't regret it. Ten dollars first person to make one. If you can make one in the next shot, ten bucks. Got it! <laughs> you see that? <laughs> Mason, ten bucks. Come on. Any one, you go. It's got to be a legal shot. It'll be a legal shot. Oh! Dang it! You owe him ten dollars. <laughs> Thirteen to the fourteen. You guys, I will give Chef Mike credit. That's the best. Not only the best alligator dish, but that's one of the best dishes I've ever tried. Let's go talk to the boys from Pennsylvania. How would y'all rate that dish right there? Yeah, yeah, awesome. Or higher. Gosh, Dang, he's dang whooping it. you. It's because he plays on this table all the time. Oh! And how are you going to whip on that? <laughs> I, well, I was trying to bring my ball down there. And... Alright, here's the comeback. Oh, my, let's see. oh my gosh, you left me in. Come on, babe. The fans don't want me to cut it from the okay. pool section without you making one. Come on. That yellow one. 
kitchen I don't even have words for that. Just cut that part out. So we came here to kill an alligator with a pellet gun, an air rifle. And we did just that and you're getting ready to go. But because of the conditions that, now I, I can't tell you all of it yet because there's quail. Underneath that car. Did Look at him. That's a beautiful sight right there. Whoa, little Speedy Gonzales. <laughs> Y'all, she's just like a kid. So anyhow, we did do an alligator hunt. Because these things out here are so smart, it's hot. They're already down in the water column. They're not just out laying on the bank. We slipped up to an area where Mason was hog hunting the other day and two of his best hog dogs got eight by gators. We got up probably 65 yards from the alligator that we wanted to take. And you'll just have to watch it from here. Can you see him from right there? He just went under. Just went under. Are you in the yards? Yeah. Oh yeah, nice. How, how many yards was that? 50, exactly. 50 yards with a pellet gun. Like Red Riders have came a long way. A long way? Long way. It is hot. Yes, sir. It's 180 degrees here in South Florida. Literally. You think you can put him on your shoulders? Yeah. He's not the biggest gator in Florida, and he's not the one that killed both of Mason's dogs. But he's the one we want. He's a perfect eating gator. Mason, do you have faith in that pellet gun? Look where it is. A little iffy, but he waved yeah, over he and waved, said bye. He waved goodbye. Right in his there. eyeball. It's nice. That thing don't play. That's the one really good advantage of coming to the Lightsey family ranch. Besides the great cooking and the awesome hunting. You can hunt year round here. Most places in Florida and all around the country you have to hunt with seasons. Here you can hunt an alligator year round. Look at our taxi driver right here. I didn't think y'all got one. Her and Moose. All right, let's talk about this gun for a second. Give us the rundown on what this crazy looking thing is, what the advantage of this thing is. Here's your time to shine. All right, well, this is an FX Impact M3. Um, the company that I work for, which is Donnie FL Saber Tactical, we make the, uh, upper rail lower rail comp like a comp plate we make the uh the weights and we make the butt stocks for this gun and the and the grips but this gun here many have tried with different bigger calibers but i feel that 22 is going to be the best caliber to use for doing gators and removing any kind of invasive species so that's what i chose was 22 and it worked 50 yard shot gator went down Easy, and that would have killed a 12 footer just as easy just as easy yeah it's all shot i think it's all about shot placement not about the size of the projector oh yeah. yeah i mean we killed we harvested this gator just for meat if we wanted to harvest a bigger gator we could harvest any size gator with that gun Correct. show them one of the bullets or whatever you call them they're these are slugs that i'm shooting and it's a 35 grain griffin air gun ammo and the guy hand makes them all so Works. What's, what's your info if people want to get a hold of you? You can contact us at DonnieFL.com. That's how you find us, or you can contact me on Instagram. I'm T Dubs, T E underscore D U B Z. All right, that's a good looking gun. I know that. I know we did work with it yesterday with iguanas. Not this one, right? A different no, one. A different one. This is, a this is what this one has a slug liner in it. The other one's a pellet liner. They just two different disciplines of shooting. This is for more PRS style shooting, different you know distances where the slug liner or the pellet liners more for bench rest style shooting or speed shooting. Now, if people don't want this type of pellet gun, they can get any type of pellet gun through you, right? Yes. Do you still do the lever action Red Riders? Uh, we do have them, not on our website, but we do have them. <laughs> <laughs> we How do many all, we shots can somebody expect to get out of one tank? 
uh, one tank, one fill, you can get anywhere between, depending on how much air you're pushing and how heavy their projectile is, uh, you can get anywhere between two to four mags. Each mag, depending on caliber, is from 28 all the way up to, I think, or 28 to, I think it's 18 or 19. So, and then it's always good to have a good stable platform. You cannot, I cannot just like express that enough. Stability with air rifles is everything. You and yardage to, right exactly knowing your knowing your yardage because these are proje projected by air not by powder so you want to make sure that you have everything to the t all your you know all your eyes dotted and all your t's crossed and then you could be successful huh i like it i know i love that one i was shooting yesterday reagan said my feet were nasty he's washing the dog this is my hot and this is hilarious that's the cleanest his feet have been in a long time. Here, give me a minute. Your feet are nasty? Oh, dude. <laughs> Look at this oh crap. Oh, my God. Look Gotta wash off my camera. Yeah, you gotta bit. add another quarter. You gotta add another quarter. Let's show them what the Lysis Family Ranch has to yeah. offer for sleeping accommodations. Are your accommodations. Maybe we should turn a light on. Yeah. Oh, look at that big old Billy largemouth up there. But have you ever caught one that big? Yeah, all the time. Babe. Every time I go. You're starting to sound like so Mason. So you need a rod. She just takes her thumb and moves it around in the water. So this is one of the oh, rooms. So they have nice a bunch. Place. Look at the bathroom. They even got a bear that will hand you toilet paper. Oh, this is nice. Heck yeah. Would you want me to bring you on a date here? Yeah, I want to go on a date here. Would you want me to bring you on a date? Yeah. <laughs> he just said that, so... I'll be the little Look spoon. Look how heavy he is. I'll be the little spoon. No, you need to get. <laughs> <laughs> and if you're here and you need a good guide, that fine specimen right there and his dog will take y'all and put you on. Oh. What all do you offer here, Mason? Wild boar, quail? If you walk to the back of the turkey, building, you see quail right now. Turkey, gators, uh, deer, whitetail, axis, black buck, um, pheasant. We do some tower shoots Eggs. and quail. I think we named them all. Pretty much everything. Everything. If it lives in Florida and it's legal to kill, we kill it. So right here is one of my favorite parts of this place. The five stand. You can come here and shoot around the clays. They throw them from all different angles. They even have shotguns if you don't have one. Under the shade, they got earplugs. They have everything you need to come here and have a good time. Now the nature tour is absolutely amazing. We don't have time to do it right now. But when you ride through this ranch, it's 1,200 acres, you will see massive whitetails, axis deer, black bucks. You can come out here and have the time of your life. But before we end this video, I gotta take it back to the gator hunt and show you something that I've really never even seen in person. It's gonna be exciting and you're not gonna believe it. Oh, right there's the entrance. Dang, it's narrow. Uh oh, he's moving. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I just hurt my butt. <laughs> you got your peepers. Dude, there's a great big one back there in the back. A great big one? Yeah. How big is that hole? It's big enough for you, babe. Come on. No. Come on. That's I'm more worried about the ones in there. Mason, get down in there. I'll hold on to your feet. I ain't going in there. Whoo. That's the first time I've actually seen an active gator den on my own. That was pretty dope. If you guys want to come do this and experience it yourself, Lightsies Family Ranch. I'll put the information right here. If you want some cool pellet guns, where's he at? T-dubs. Old T-dubs. You can come see us at Donnie FL. You can come see me, T-dubs, however you want to find us. Pellet shop, Utah air guns. Everyone sells the cool air guns. For all you single ladies out there, right here, Mason Lightsey. Should I put your Instagram right there? He does have a dog, but it's handicapped. So if it's you do plan, <laughs> if you do plan on dating yeah, Mason, you get the dog in the package and it's special. Got so. three legs. Yeah, it's special. I just forgot I didn't introduce one person. Did I introduce Reagan Lightsey? Our taxi driver. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, I did. I couldn't end it without introducing Reagan. That's it, folks. It's time to get up out of here. Get the heck out of shape. See y'all.